Well, because the, it, when once you've stimulated autophagy, there is one goal for that cell, and that is survival. So everything in there is on high alert. Okay. Everything is going to be in your survival interest. So a virus is not in your survival interest. So it pushes it out. So it's kind of like an emergency signal because there's not been food for a while. So it, right. it's kind of like the last, the last attempt to do everything the body can to help you make it through this period of hunger. Or, That's right. That's right. Okay. You've put yourself in this state of extreme healing. And it's all based off of this idea that your body wants to stay alive. Okay, so that's, are you writing your book that that's good for balancing sex hormones and preventing colds? So yeah, with, with autophagy, it's great for preventing colds. What, here's what's interesting about autophagy for sex hormones, is that the major part of your brain for both men and women that control hormonal, all hormonal control is your hypothalamus and pituitary. That part of the brain does not have a blood-brain barrier. So it's very vulnerable to toxins. So whenever we have massive toxic exposure, that part of the brain starts to malfunction. We see this with uh, polycystic ovarian syndrome, most common hormonal imbalance for women.